Hello friends, today we are going to see how to connect a Django project with a PostgreSQL database. So let's get started. First of all, we have to open a folder in VS Code in order to create a Django project in it. So simply I will create a new folder and open it. In order to create a Django project, first of all, we have to create a virtual environment. For that, open the terminal. Install the virtual environment package by tapping the command pip install virtual env. The package is installed. Now create an environment by tapping a command virtual env and your environment name. You can write anything instead of venv. So our virtual environment is created. Now we have to activate it. For that, type this command and hit enter. Now let's install Django package. For that, type the command pip install django here our django package is installed now we have to install another package for the database connection for that type pip install uh, let's see the package first open your browser and type psycog2 and hit enter open this package link now copy the command from here and paste in our terminal. Please don't press enter. We have to add uh, something more. Just add minus binary to the command and now hit enter. After this, let's create our Django project. For that, type the command Django admin start project and your project name. Uh, here our project is created. Inside this folder we have settings.py file. Just open it. Now scroll down. Here in database section, we have to make some changes. Again, let's go to our browser and search for Django PostgreSQL Connect. Go to the Django official documentation page. Uh, click on PostgreSQL or just scroll down. Here, copy this post key sequel and in our vs code just replace it with sqlite 3 again go to your browser and scroll down uh, we have to scroll more i think it is very down Here it is. Copy this from name to port and paste it in here. Now we have to open our PG admin for the application. Let's create a new database here. Right click on database, then click on create database. In database, give our database name. I will simply write sample. Now we have to focus on the owner. This is also called the host name or user name. Uh, it is by default 
post Chris. I will not change it. Now click on save. Here our database is created. Now go to our VS code. In the name we will write the database name which is sample. In the user we will write the username which is also the owner name post Greece. In password we have to give the password which we created while installing our post Greece SQL database. Um, in the host we will write localhost. In the port we will give 5432 and that's it. Now in the terminal first go to our project app by tapping the command cd app name which is post -gree connect. And let's try to migrate now. For that type the command python manage.py make migrations. Oh, here we got the error. Uh, actually, we have wrong spelling of manage.py. Let's type it again. Python manage.py make migrations. Uh, now, uh, see it worked. Now, let's type our last command. Python manage.py migrate. Uh, so, here our connection is successfully done. Now let's check it in our pgadmin4 application. Uh, right click on sample and then click on refresh. Now click on schema. Scroll down and click on tables. Here we can see all our migrated Django tables. That is all guys. I hope this video has solved your problem. Please do like this video and also subscribe this channel thank you for watching